Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. We got the 88 Quadicare Ford Credit Red Carpet Lease Ford Thunderbird. 96, 97, they ran the Ford Thunderbird. And 98, they did away with the Thunderbird and moved to the Ford Taurus. The first four-door <laughs> NASCAR. So, that didn't really go over real well with everybody, but they kind of brought in what we got now. A lot of four-door cars out there. So, we had the Quality Care Four Taurus. Had the red, white, and blue. Probably one of the best paint schemes probably ever on a race car. Uh, there's probably a few other favorites of mine. Um... I like Davy Allison's Tetsuko Avalon. That's a beautiful car as well. But this was just a really cool car. So later that year, they did a Batman and Robin. Kenny Irwin actually drove the Robin. I may pull those out later on if you guys want to see it. But uh, Batman is all over this car. Quality care service. Batman on the hood. For credit on the side, got the bat logo on the deck lid. Very cool car, one of my favorites, also. <laughs> then, in that's 98, so 99 rolls around. And this here is actually a super speedway car. If you notice, the uh, number on the top is an orange fluorescent and the 88 on the side is just red they use that on the super speedways back in the day uh, daytona talladega so that they could the spotters could see that number not a whole lot of difference between the um the 98 and the 99 car this would be the year that dale jarrett would go to win the winston cup championship they did a reverse color of that car for uh susan the Breast Cancer Foundation. It doesn't say it on the car, but that's what it was about. They did reverse colors at Charlotte. I think you ran it at the um, the All-Star Race. The Winston. So that was a beautiful car. So then in 19... <laughs> 99 they also did these under the lights chrome illusion um, cars very cool they did quite a few of the chrome illusion cars don't didn't really buy a whole lot though that one was a gift i believe i can't remember so then ford would change their taurus once again in the year 2000 and the car would look pretty much the same except for the front end. They would change up the grill headlights. Then that particular year they also ran a military. They did a Marines, Air Force, Navy. This is a cheaper one as well. This is a winter circle. Um, would have been $10, $12 at Walmart, Kmart at the time. But it's pretty cool. Then they would do the last um, year of quality care. This would have been in 2000. Quality care and red carpet lease. Tetsuko, for credit, all those would leave the team. And they did a special car saying thanks for five great years. Your friends of Quality Care and Ford Credit. So, segueing into the next generation of uh, sponsors would be the UPS. And I meant to show this 
in the future video you're watching, <laughs> so it's kind of backwards, <laughs> this would have been the last year of Winston Cup racing. So they did a bunch of all the champions through all the years. He won one. So Winston Cup was the title sponsor from 1971 to 2003. Yeah, I remember going to the race and getting free Winston cigarettes and uh, Copenhagen and Skull and everything else. Camels. I probably should put that in the video, but you know what I'm talking about, you old race fans. So that was a vehicle. This will segue into the next video um, of the uh, UPS. I got a cool one I want to show you as well. Um, they started doing the plastic cars. And they did a two-tone. They did these where they released them all in, in clear plastic. And the car was UPS on one side and clear on the other. And the only way they could do that would be on a plastic body. Sorry it's so dusty. These cars have been here a long time. But, uh, yep, the segues into the next video. Thanks for watching.